Flowers are an integral part of the plant world, but did you know that they serve a vital role beyond just looking pretty? Let's dive into the fascinating world of flowers. Plants have various parts, each with specific functions that contribute to their growth, reproduction, and survival. In this video, we will study about the basic parts of flower and their functions. Understanding the structure of a flower involves recognizing both its vegetative and reproductive parts, each playing a crucial role in the plant's life cycle. Vegetative parts are those parts of a flower which do not participate in sexual reproduction like petals and sepals. However, reproductive parts are parts of a flower which participate in the sexual reproduction such as pistil and stamen. In case of vegetative parts, Sepals, a prominent outermost part of the flower, usually green and leaf-like, which protect the flower when it is in bud stage while providing support and covering for the delicate inner structures. Petals. These are the colourful, often delicate parts of the flower that are responsible for attracting pollinators like bees, butterflies and birds. It surrounds the reproductive parts of the flower. A group of petals in a flower is called the corolla. In terms of reproductive parts, stamen is the male reproductive organ of a flower that produces pollen. A group of stamens in a flower is called the andrisium. Stamen is divided into two parts. The upper sac-like structure called anther, which produces pollen, that contains the male gametes, sperm cells. While lower end having stalk-like structure known as filament that supports the anther, where pollen is produced. The filament also transports water and nutrients to the anther and helps disperse pollen. Pistil. It is the female reproductive part of the flower, typically found in the centre of the flower. A group of pistils is called a gynoecium. It has three components, a sticky knob at the top of the pistil where pollen lands during fertilisation is called as stigma where pollen grain will land which leads into style that is a long tube-like structure that connects the stigma to the ovary. Ovary is the basal portion of the pistil that contains ovules, which are female egg cells that develop into seeds. So I hope now you all understand that flowers are not just a beautiful part of plant, but they also play a crucial role in plant reproduction. Next time you admire a flower, remember the intricate parts that make up this natural marvel. Remember to like, share and comment your thoughts on today's video. Thanks for watching.